everyone, welcome to Slimming World Sunday. I'm having a cup of tea. I feel like that should be like my new trademark thing. I'm having a cup of tea. <laughs> um, yeah, so it was the race yesterday. Um, I put the vlog up. Thank you so much to my little brother for getting as much film as he could. Bless him. Um, it was difficult on the course because you couldn't really like completely follow us around and they didn't realise there was like little ways that you could go in and stuff but anyway I'm so grateful to have what I do have on film and there's some amazing pictures on Instagram that um, other people like spectators fam like other people in their teens family that were taking pictures on professional cameras and they would just come up fantastic so big thank you to them um, so if you wanted to check them out, go over to my Instagram, it's Gemma F underscore SW, um, and there'll be pictures on there as well. <coughs> Sorry, I woke up really, really hungry, I've not eaten yet, I'm just having a cup of tea, really need to get some water in today to rehydrate. My hands are so sore, like the bones, there's not like bruises and stuff, there's a few, I'm a bit scratched up. Um, on my hands, but the bones are sore, really, really sore. My legs, they came out fine, didn't really get that many bruises this time, which is a bit mad. I thought I'd be covered, but um, yeah, it was just the best day, the absolute best day. I just, in my element, absolutely in my element, I loved it. And considering I'm quite girly, um, I got stuck in, I fell in the mud more than once. I mean, we was trudging through mud that was coming up to our knees at one point. Thick mud. I thought I was going to sink forever. Um, I thought they was going to have to get a tractor to get me out at one point. But we powered through, powered through as a team. Um, there was a slide um that just took you straight into mud water like a pond literally a pond it was as deep as my head i went straight under like literally straight under that frightened me because it was so the water was so cold at this point i mean we'd been in and out of like waste water um but going down the slide and under the water it was just like a, a shock to the system but then you've got to like swim or walk to the other side and so we were all like <gasps> trying to get our breath back trying to like breathe our way through it was just it was immense honestly i cannot wait to do it again next year um to think like my whole life i've been big i've been unfit now I'm 30 and a mum of three, I've decided it's time to start doing all this stuff. So it's never too late, never ever too late. There was a 70 year old man doing the nighttime one. I mean, you wouldn't catch me doing a nighttime one, no way. Um, and I know next year they've got a secret bunker that they're um, going to be adding into the blast. But it was just, it was just amazing. And I stayed on plan the whole day. All right, I had 13 and a half sins, but that's what they're there for, aren't they? Um, it was just the best, the absolute best. Um, sorry, I'm not being rude. I'm just, oh, I'm exhausted. <laughs> Today, I don't think I'll be getting out of my um, pyjamas at all. <laughs> I washed my hair four times last night and there's still mud in it, but It'll be all right. It'll be good for me. So yeah, I will come back to you when I've got some breakfast. Before I come back to you when I've got some breakfast, I just want to say thank you so much for your guys' support yesterday. It means the absolute world to me. I cannot believe how many messages I got, how many comments on my pictures. Like, just thank you so so much. It's just amazing so thank you so it's quarter to nine and i'm just gonna have some breakfast now i've got two eggs my whole meal roll um for my healthy h to be two slim and rolled sausages and two tablespoons of barbecue sauce for two sins that's all the twos <laughs> um i know it's something that i have a lot but it's just what i fancy this morning i'm still drinking some water um i'm gonna have a cup of tea as well and i'll probably have a pear 
a bit after and um, that is level by the way it's just where the bowls round um so yeah i'm gonna tuck in and enjoy this now because i'm really hungry <laughs> so it's about half two now quarter to three something like that and I'm making Mayflower curry tonight. I've not had any lunch just because I've been full up from um, the sausage and egg rolls. So I'm not gonna eat just for the sake of it. I might have a piece of fruit after. Um, this is really hurting my arms. <laughs> but I'm feeling really stiff. So I'm just gonna walk to B&M and get some Mayflower curry powder because I haven't got none. So that's always great. Thing, isn't it and I need to get some green peppers and that in Aldi so I thought we'd just go for a nice slow walk um, and get a few bits just me and the girls while the boys are at home playing PlayStation so yeah that's what I'm doing and then this afternoon like a bit when I get back I will probably do like homework and spellings with Kai for a while yeah that's what we're up to. I'm absolutely knackered, can you tell? So I'm just going to tuck into a pink lady apple and a cup of tea before I start making dinner. So dinner tonight is a Mayflower curry for four sins for the 28 grams of powder. And I'm sorry it's a bit dark, That's but spicy. I've got it's spicy chicken, mushrooms, onions, green pepper, peas That's and basmati spicy. rice. Yep, I'm going to tuck into this now because I'm really hungry where I didn't really have lunch. So I'm going to enjoy this and then I'm going to have, I don't know what I'm going to have after, but I'll come back and show you. So for my evening snack, I am having a cup of tea using my, the like, last bit of my milk allowance. I am having a Nutella Be Ready Bar for five and a half sins and an easy peeler. I know I said this week I wanted to keep it under 10 sins but I've needed my sins the last few days so I am being kind to myself. I'm still under, I'm on so five and a half for the Be Ready, four for the Mayflower so that's nine and a half and then two for the sauce, 11 and a half so it's not that bad. Um, I'm having an easy peeler as well. I hope everyone has an amazing day on plan. Let me know how you're all getting on. Um, I'm achy. <laughs> really achy tonight. I'm really, really like shattered, tired. So I'm going to enjoy this. I'm going to have a nice hot bath because I've still got mud in my ears <laughs> and up my nose. Um, I'm going to have a nice hot bath. I'm going to wash my hair again. And yeah, be ready and fresh for tomorrow. I'm going to attempt Meta tomorrow. I'm sure I'll be feeling a lot better um, and the buzz is still there like I'm still over the moon and we're looking at the next one that we're going to do which is a longer course and yeah it just looks immense so yeah I am so so excited and I'm so grateful to absolutely every one of you that has said how well I did um, especially on the last bit well the bit before the last bit where I was going over the top of that um like climbing wall thing I freaked out I genuinely freaked out and I started crying at the top and I was like please don't let me fall and they all come and help me get over it I really got really really scared so um being in the team just made it so much better because I could have so easily have just gone straight back down that thing I was debating but I've done it and um I'm so proud of myself I really really am and I wouldn't have been able to do that five stone ago they wouldn't, they wouldn't even enter my head of, of doing something like that. Would not even enter my head. But now I've got the bug. I want to do it. I want to do more. And I want to do bigger and better and exciting things. So watch this space. But yeah, I'm going to enjoy this now. And I'll see you all soon. Bye, everyone. <laughs>